I just spent what I consider a complete waste of time looking at Tommy Lee and apparently that Vine girl Brittany Furlane's Instagram. What's up, pups? How you guys doing? I'm doing great, thanks for asking. Luna and I are here today to do a Target haul from the Target doll. You just yawned and licked me at the same time. Uh, so today's video is a Target dollar spot haul. They actually put out all of the Valentine's Day dollar spot stuff before Christmas at my Target, so yeah. Now, I did not buy everything they had because truth be told, they had so much stuff. More stuff than I've ever seen for like a specific holiday period at Target dollar spot. So there are so many things. I highly suggest you check multiple Targets because I, like I said, this collection of like dollar spot stuff was the biggest I've ever seen. I got a few really cool things though. So I wanna show you what I found. I tried to pick things that I can utilize as well. Cause in the past I know I've bought stuff just to like feature in a video and then it kind of just sits in my room and it ends up like being given away or it just sits. Um, so I try to buy things that I can actually utilize. So uh, if this haul seems kind of weird, uh, it's because I bought things that I knew I could use. So yeah. <laughs> I am like, I'm very tired today by the way. Like I have no idea why I'm so sleepy. I had a Red Bull like an hour and a half ago. Here it is. I don't know. So the first thing they had were these mini crowns. Now I'm not sure if these mini crowns were for New Year's or if they were for Valentine's, but they were in like the Valentine's stuff. So they had an eight count of mini crowns. I thought these were really cute and I got them because this year is my 10 year anniversary on YouTube. So I'm saving this for like a little party that I'm throwing for myself because I'm weird. And these crowns were $3. So the next thing I got are these Valentine cards with like little dogs. Um, the dogs have like glitter and they're kind of see-through. It's $3. Oh, there's dogs and cats. Oh, I thought it was just dogs. It says there's 63 pieces in here, but it makes 21 cards. So you get like the string and the little animal and the cards. Um, yes, I am a 10 year old child. Yes, I still give out Valentine's to my friends. I think it's fun and cute and I will never stop doing it. They had a whole bunch of different ones for this. They had like unicorns and dinosaurs and army men. I think last year I got the army men, but I just really liked these because the animals have glitter in them. So that's why I got these. I'm not like too happy about finding out there are cats in there, but I have a lot of friends who are cat people. So I'll make sure that they get the cats. So this I got, and I'm just like excited to play with this myself. It was $1. You get four of these Valentines that you just, they're perforated, so you like rip them. But it has play sand. So it's like little tiny things of kinetic sand that like, you know, the ones that like, yeah, they usually have it like Brookstone or something. Like if you walk inside the store, they have the kinetic sand, you play with it. You guys know what I'm talking about. Either way, I thought this was so cool. I want to play with it because I think kinetic sand is fun. I actually hate regular sand, but for some reason this is just like really exciting to me. Along the same lines, I know this is like a super popular thing on YouTube right now, which why? I don't know. Um, but this was also a dollar. You get four little kisses full of slime, but not just any slime, it's glitter slime. So it says, be mine, Valen slime. I, so I picked this one up because I have actually I haven't touched slime since I was like, I don't know, five or six. So I'm not even too familiar with how this is gonna feel, but I was curious, so that's why I got it. The next thing I got, which I'm really excited to use, are string lights. Um, these were $3. I'm gonna be using these on like my craft fair table because I think I have two or three craft fairs that I'm vending in February. So I thought this would be like a cute addition to put on my table. They are battery operated, um, but they're just little like conversation hearts that say different things. It doesn't say how many of the conversation hearts are on it, but it does say that it is a six foot long cord. Looks like you get about 10 lights on there. So it's a pretty decent amount of lights. It'll stretch across my table. So this was really cool. They have glass frames this year. And when I bought this frame, this is the only one that I found. But when I went back to Target about a week later after Christmas, they already had other frames that were even cuter than this one. Um, but I still like this one. It was $5. Um, it's a four by six photo frame. The other ones that they had had like roses around it. I think there was one that said like BFFs or best friend or something. It's glass, which is really cool. I don't think I've seen anything um, like glass in the dollar spot, even like their wine, well no, that's a lie. 
Uh, for Christmas this past year, they had a two pack of wine glasses that were glass, but normally they've been plastic. So maybe they're just trying to transition over to like a higher quality product. Um, but five bucks, really cute frame. I plan on taking a photo for Galentine's Day with my girlfriends this year and throwing it in this frame and then setting it up in my office. So, so the next thing is actually kind of a frame too. Uh, I don't think it's it's meant to be marketed as a frame, but you actually can make it a frame. Um, it was three dollars. It's a paperweight or like a desk weight thing. In the back of the image it says Cupid is stupid, but you can actually take this out and you can put your own photo in it. I thought this was really fun, especially because I already have like two or three of this type of photo frame in my room. Um, so I liked that like it has the glitter in it and you know, it's cute to say Cupid is stupid, but then I think after Valentine's Day I'll most likely find a photo that I like. Um, that fits like this size and then I'll take this Cupid is stupid paper out put it on the photo cut my photo to fit and then stick it in this little frame guy so yeah this last little pile of stuff um, are actually things that I got for when I do like little makeshift Galentine's gifts for my girlfriends this year I'm not actually gonna go crazy especially because you know your girl is working full-time as a youtuber and a crafter so um, I don't have like a ton of money to spend but I do still like to make sure that my girlfriends know that I appreciate them and I love them um, so what I did is I picked up some favor bags these are one dollar each so they have this little crystally gemstone bag they had a plain canvas bag with some pink glitter hearts all over it now this one was kind of cool because it looks like those backpacks that are really popular right now but it's a pink bag and it has like this plastic on the front and the last bag I picked up is purple with polka dots and it says you plus me equals glitter. Not sure how that logic works out, but it was a cute bag, so. So for $5, they had this balloon banner and it says hashtag gals. They had a whole section in the Valentine stuff for Galentine's Day, which I thought was so fun. Um, and I thought this was just really cute to have. As far as I know um, from people that I've talked to, I think that you can actually reuse these. There's a way to like get the air back out or something. I'm not too sure about that, but I would love to like be able to save these, but if not, no big deal, it was $5, but they had a bunch of different ones too. Okay, so last three things. Um, this was $1 and they're temporary tattoos. You get 22 of them for $1. Um, again, this was in the Galentine's Day section, so they say things like besties and girls rule and BFF I love you um, And there's some like conversation hearts. So again for one dollar They had this three button pack. So this one says BFF. I love you. This one says girl power XOXO I just thought these were really cute This one would be especially cute if you wanted to like give them as a gift and you pin them on the inside of the bag so that they show through this plastic part. The last thing I got, this was the only one. So I'm assuming that when I went to the dollar spot before Christmas, they were just getting like the first couple shipments. Um, so this was the only one that I can find. I haven't been able to find them since. I feel like these are getting picked up rather quickly because it's such a good buy. But this was one dollar. Um, it's a note card set. So you're getting a note card, the envelope, and then two enamel pins. So one of the pins says Cupid is stupid. The other one says fries before guys. Just from looking at other people's dollar spot videos, I know they have another pin set. Um, but this was the only one I could find, like I said. I do want to go back and get another pin set, if not three more, so that I can use this as like a gift to my girlfriends. Um, but I just thought these pins were so cute. They're like really nice quality for like being essentially 50 cents each. However you want to do the math, because obviously you're getting the note card in the envelope too, but um, yeah super cute. I know this haul was a little bit smaller than I normally do. Um, I try to spend like a decent amount of money in the dollar spot each time to showcase a lot of different items that they have. They had sign decor, um, like little wooden signs, and they had a bunch of different like pens and pencils and stuff like that, like really cute things. But like I said, I was trying to just get stuff that I can actually utilize. What I can plan on doing is the next time I go to Target, I'll make sure I bring my daily vlogging camera and I'll feature that in a video on my daily channel. Um, so if you are not subscribed, make sure you do so link is down in the description Luna's breathing heavy because there's kids playing outside and she's like fighting fighting herself to not bark good job girl good job hold it in anyway guys I really hope you enjoyed this video if this is the first video that you're seeing of mine hi I'm Kaylee I'm sorry I'm so tired in this video I'm not normally like this please subscribe so that you can see my super fun and bubbly 
quirky personality. And yes, that was not a humble statement, but I don't care. <laughs> anyway, links to my Twitter, Snapchat, and Instagram are also down below. I'll see you guys next time in another video. Bye, everybody.